you blocked me because you thought I was gonna put out a, a bashing video towards you because of the, what we talked about, my G. Like, come on, man. Like, come on, dude. It's really not that fucking serious. What is good, Diamond Dynasty, baby? Welcome back to another mother freaking video. There's a lot of girls with me right now. Got a lot of drugs with me right now. But I'd rather just get <laughs> right. Let's not go too soon now. I feel the same. And a lot of girls hit it right now. Hey, oh, my God. God. I would rather pass that blunt to you. And today, baby, y'all already know what the fuck going on, as you can tell by the title of this video, man. So, before we get into this video, guys, I do want to say thank you guys so freaking much. I think we're at 125K. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I want to thank all you guys out there for supporting me, showing me much love, you know what I'm saying? Supporting every fucking video. Every time I post a video, it's like you guys show so much fucking love, man. Like, I appreciate each and every one of you guys from the bottom of my balls. Not the bottom of my balls, because I ain't got no balls. The bottom of my heart, okay? I love you guys so freaking much, man. The way y'all telling y'all Uncle Joe's that he's a hoe. And, you know, even though Uncle Joe does get in his feelings sometimes, because, you know, it gets kind of tough when people talk shit about you constantly. Every single fucking video I put out, you know what I'm saying? He does feel some type of way. But the word is getting around, you know, so that's all I can ask. I appreciate each and every every one of you guys man for telling your friends telling your homegirls your co-workers and everybody your nieces and nephews and shit you know what i'm saying a lot of you guys send me like some cool ass fucking videos and clips of your nieces and nephews or your sons and daughters doing my intro and i think it's the cutest thing the sweetest thing you know i try to post them on ig i love the kids you know what i'm saying i love kids to death okay and just anybody in general who wants to show the dynasty love you know it always brightens my day to see you guys do my shit because it's you know what i'm saying it's like we a family you know so i appreciate you guys once again all right for two i do want to do a shout out today and it's gonna be for miss yummy bites tv okay if you watch my channel you should watch hers too she has some pretty lit content over there guys everybody go check it out if you like mukbangs mukbangs i'm not quite sure how you say it guys correct me if i'm wrong well i can't be wrong it's got to be mukbangs or mukbangs one of them okay but let me know in the comments down below which one it is all right click the link in the description down below and y'all make sure y'all check out her channel too she's doing big things go subscribe to her motherfucking channel here is just a brief preview of one of her mukbangs right here so good Mm. <laughs> mm. 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 All right, guys, so if you enjoyed that, make sure that you, like I said, click the link in my description down below. Make sure that you subscribe to Miss Yummy Bites TV. Show her some love, all right, guys? So let's go ahead without further ado and let's get right into this motherfucking video, guys. Make sure that you subscribe to my YouTube channel, like this video. Make sure you comment your thoughts and opinions down below. Share this video with a friend. Hit that bell so you can be notified every time I post another little ass video. Make sure that you DM me at the real diamond m and let me know what i should be reacting to next and tell a friend to tell a friend today ain't your mom today uncle joe that nigga's still a hoe and let's get right into this mother freaking video guys all right so let's get to it so a lot of you guys have been requesting that i go ahead and do an update video on what happened with mila a lot of you guys had a lot of questions because you guys said that some dms were edited out and yes, they were accidentally, guys. There was like 10 minutes of fucking footage that I just, for some reason, I guess I was just like in a hurry because I was trying to get somewhere, guys, and it was already late. I think by the time I uploaded the Mila J video, it was up at like 11.30 p.m., okay? And as soon as I finished the video, I was out the motherfucking door, okay? So I was kind of in a rush. That's what happens when you be rushing and shit, okay? So everybody slow it down and try to take your time with everything that you do, you feel me? <laughs> everything that you do okay no pun intended but we're gonna go ahead and get right into these messages here okay so i'm gonna show y'all all of the dms all right 
and a lot of you guys wanted to also know if she responded back or not so we're just going to briefly go over the ones that we already went through and in the midst of it i think it would be easier to just go down the line on everything that was said okay even the things that i already went over briefly and then i'll go into more detail with the things that i left out accidentally as well all right so let's start the screen recording all right so first message y'all already know she says i'll appreciate if you stop talking bad on my name okay i say what bad did i say about you out of curiosity with the thinking emoji okay of course i said sat i didn't want to sit on her lap you know i know homo bro but wait it is homo because we homo but anyway don't you hate when homo people say no homo so what is it like no homo homo like it's just confusing anyway guys so i said what did i say i'm bad about you basically out of curiosity so she says i don't know question mark i don't watch your videos People just always tell me you're giving me a bad name and I don't appreciate it because you have a crowd watching you. You're an influencer. Well, clearly, nigga, you know I'm an influencer, okay? okay? But there's a lot of people who use their influence for good. There's a lot of people who use their influence for bad. So I guess you're trying to say that I should be using my influence for good, which I agree with you on that. However, it's just like, nigga, I ain't never bashed you. So it is what it is. I'm a joke around for show for show. I got jokes for you. I got jokes for Chrissy. And I'm sure you got some jokes for my naked ass too, okay? It is what it is. Say what you want to say, you feel me? So I respond back, LOL. Dude, it would probably be beneficial to watch for yourself and make your own judgment instead of blindly believing other people's opinions, okay? Go to the source. Yes, you went to the source, you came to me, my G. But the way you came to me about the situation, I don't feel was the best way to come at it, nigga. You feel me? I'ma say it again because that's just what I feel, okay? It's not me being emotional about it. It's not me being in my feelings. It's just me reading that energy, okay? And the vibe was all wrong, okay? So I say, if anything, I done had your back when other influencers were dragging your ass. And you and me both know that. I just ask that you go see for yourself before you come for me. I ain't the nigga you need to be worried about. I'm just saying, all right? So she likes to comment, all right? So she comments back, I watch you because you're the only one I saw that defended me about the mugshot. Okay, let me stop it there, all right? Let me stop it there. And the reason why I wanna stop it there is because didn't you just say, let me go back, didn't you say, I don't watch your videos. People just always tell me you're giving me a bad name. But then you turn around and say, I watch you because you're the only one I saw. Okay, so I don't know guys, y'all can make the judgment. I'm not me J, so I can't tell you what she meant by that. But you just said you didn't watch me. People just telling you shit. Now you say you watch me because I'm the only one that defended you about the mugshot. Now I'm confused, okay? Somebody make it make sense in the comments down below, all right? So then she says, my mom always tells me you're defending me and I appreciate when you do. So even if your, mo if your mom is even telling you, mom's is telling you, bro, that I'm defending you, but you still coming at me this type of way over he say, she say, or a messy ass supporter who's just trying to rile up some shit. Is that what you're saying? Okay, so, you know, like, I see a lot of you guys' opinions in the comments down below, and I agree with some of you guys' opinions, okay? I ain't gonna say which ones I agree with. However, <laughs> however, you know what I'm saying? I feel where y'all are coming from, all right? Just know I know, okay? Just know I know, and I'm not stupid, all right? But anyway, so, um, she says, I appreciate when you defend me, basically. I just don't want my name being dragged by someone, someone with 100k subs, like come on. When guys, please comment down below, when I dragged Miss Mila J. Please let me know when I dragged her, because I just don't recall dragging Miss Mila J or dragging Chrissy for that matter, okay? So leave a comment down below, maybe I'm missing something, okay? Maybe I'm tripping. Maybe my mind ain't working right, okay? You know what I'm saying? Maybe, you feel me? So, she says, and you're right. I'll look. That's why I came to you like an adult instead of doing the most, 100. However, 
okay, maybe you weren't exactly doing the most, but I feel like you were being extra by the way that you came at me, my G, okay? So, you know what I'm saying? If you come at me, like if I come to you, Miss Mila J, and I'd be like, I would appreciate it if blah, 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 blah. Like, who is you trying to check, my nigga? Like, is you trying to check somebody? You trying to check somebody, huh? Oh no, oh no, no not going down that way you feel me and that's just how I felt you know you can say what you want to say some people thought that she wasn't trying to check me some people thought that she was just simply asking a question but it's the way you approach somebody about a situation you feel me like I said in the last video you could have easily just said hey bro look I've been hearing this and that you know like what's up with that are we cool I thought you had my back you know instead of saying I'll appreciate if you don't drag my name or you don't talk bad about me or some shit, you feel me? I'm just saying it's all in the delivery, it's all about the motherfucking approach, you feel me? So, I say, I feel you, I've been there. Don't feel good being the bad guy, but at the end of the day, the only person's opinion that matters is your own, and that is true. Like I said before, I ain't gonna harp on that again. Of course, I joke around and make my videos entertaining for my dynasty, baby, but I ain't never dragged you or Chrissy, that's the truth. If anything, I've given you both the benefit of the doubt on several occasions, okay? I doubt always, I mean, what? I always try to see both sides on like these other drama channels, okay? You did come to you did come to me as an adult, but you didn't come to clarify. You came to try to check me, LOL. At least that's how I took it. And I ain't the one to be checked, especially when I be taken up for you. I'ma always speak my mind and opinion, but I ain't never gonna make anyone out to look like a monster, which is true. That ain't my style. Tell moms I appreciate her having my back, though. That's real. It ain't easy being in the public eye and dealing with so much scrutiny, but it comes with the territory. If you ever want to address anything, hit me up, but come correct so we can have a mature conversation. All love over this way as well, all right? So, she likes it, and like... I didn't, she, I thought she was done with the conversation. I didn't think she was gonna respond back. So she did respond back and she says, LOL, you cool 100 with the heart. Appreciate the video. Thought you were gonna bash me, so I blocked you. What? So at this point, I'm like, all right, Miss Mila J, either you just being sensitive, like if you wanna start a YouTube channel, my nigga, I'm gonna give you the best piece of advice that I can give you is you have to build tough skin. If you, you gotta build tough skin to be in this business, okay? Cause like, you think what I say is bad or you think what the fan said about what I said was bad? Like, dude, you're gonna have to deal with so much more hate on your own YouTube channel, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't even think you understand the magnitude, you feel me? So, like, you blocked me because you thought I was gonna put out a, a bashing video towards you because of the, what we talked about, my G. Like, come on, man. Like, come on, dude. It's really not that fucking serious. You know, you you blocked me because of that? Because you thought I was talking shit in the video? You So you didn't want to watch the video first before you made a decision to block me. You just blocked me. But whatever, okay, you know what I'm saying, whatever. So she says, I blocked you because I thought you were gonna bash me. I appreciate the video. Good luck with your channel. I'll subscribe when I get my shit going. You know what I'm saying? Miss Mila J, I see you got your channel popping. Did you subscribe, okay? Did you subscribe? That's the motherfucking question. And I responded back. I said, oh, you tried to add me to Team Block a bitch. <laughs> I said, you show right, okay? Beto, let me know when you get your shit going. I'll support too, all right? So she hearts it and says for sure. So that was basically the end of it, guys. As you can see, we squashed the beef. It's all love on my end. It's all love on my side. With that being said, guys, if you have not already, make sure that you subscribe to Miss Mila J4K's motherfucking YouTube, okay? Make sure that y'all subscribe. She said it's gonna be some lit content on there. She says she, she gonna have some dope shit on the way. She says it's gonna be some funny shit. I don't know, guys. Y'all already know I'm gonna be doing reaction videos to her freaking videos too, all right? So, let me know in the comments down below. Do y'all think Miss Mila J is gonna have some lit ass content, guys, for us? What type of videos do y'all think that she is going to do on her page, guys? Let me a comment down below, let me know. Okay, 
And let me know also in the comments down below, what type of videos do y'all want to see from Miss Mila J? How does she make her channel a success, okay? Leave her a comment down below and let her know what you guys want to see. Y'all want to see her pranking Chrissy ass? You know what I'm saying? What exactly do y'all want to see in her videos, guys? Y'all want to see story times? Y'all want to see Q&As? Let her know in the comments down below, all right? Like I said, it's all love. I don't come on this platform to beef with anybody. I come on this platform to share my opinion, to also see both sides of a situation, to try to transform. If anything, I try to transform a negative thing into a positive thing. I try to transform drama to motherfucking positivity. Sometimes it doesn't happen that way, okay? Niggas ain't perfect, but you know, and I like to be entertaining as well. I like to add some humor in and that's just how it is on YouTube. You know what I'm saying? You gotta make yourself entertaining and you gotta bring out your natural personality as well. You feel me? So if y'all feeling this video, make sure you like this video. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. Make sure that you comment down below your thoughts and opinions. Make sure that you share this video with a friend. Make sure that you hit that bell so you can be notified every time I post another lit ass video. Make sure that you DM me at the real diamond M. And let me know what I should be reacting to next. And tell a friend to tell a friend today ain't your mama today, Uncle Joe. He's still a hoe, and I will see you guys in the next motherfucking video. Lay on there, and we out. Peace.